So now let me show you our secret effect routing. This is actually a technique that comes from analog days but works very well in your DAW. So on this vocal I want to use some reverb. So I'm opening a bus send and I'm sending to bus3 lead vocal reverb verse. And what happens now is it goes to our bus3 but there it, it gets molted to do three different reverb tracks all with an individual unit of our reverb plugin on it and it lets you mix different styles of reverbs together into your final vocal reverb and this has some features to it um, you could describe it as you can get more dense results and more complex um, reverb settings and reverb uh, imaging going on. So I just show you how this sounds. Take your chance and meet the girl One day she might be a bride So this is only our delayed plate. Now I can mix it with some of the hall setting. I'd make the call and get the job that might feed you your whole life. And then Stand up let's bring some room. They want you down. Someday we all might be free. Raise your voice against racism someday all the people see. Take a stone out of a wall. One day it will tumble down. But as you can hear, you can get pretty different results uh, for different genres and of course also you can swap out the uh, impulse response of the plugin which brings us to the Halls of Fame plugin. This is the reverb plugin that comes with Mixsample Pro and which one we are using for our reverbs. Uh, it features our own library uh, containing five of the most iconic analog reverbs um, sampled in HD quality. It's actually true stereo, which means that it's not like a mono signal spread into a stereo image, but it's actually left and right separately. So it includes some presets of the M7 reverb uh, of the EMT 250, Lexicon 480, Lexicon 960L, and some QRS reverbs. They tend to be a little bit darker. Um, we have some cathedral setting here. So you, you, you got a bunch of presets and let's just try some of them out. Like for example on the The hall, hall channel, I want a cathedral reverb and I'm loading the true stereo one. And on the room channel, I'd like to go with, uh, I think, a, a Bricasti chamber or a, like a Studio A. It's, it's a nice preset. And we can see what happens. Take your chance and meet the girl one day. This is the Procasti. She might be a bride. This is the QRS Cathedral. Take your chance and meet the girl one day. She might be a bride. Oh, they sound a little bit similar, so. I decide to, uh, let's go with a 960. Oh, actually let's take an EMT. 
Nice. Make the call and get the job. It might feed you your whole life. Stand up when they want you down. Someday we all might be free. This is a more like ambience chamber ish sound. But you, you get the idea of how to use uh, the, the multi reverb and the multi effect routing. So basically, this applies also to delays. You have one, just one send from your vocal to your delay. And then you can decide which delay you want to use on this track. So I pull them down. Raise your voice against racism someday all the people see. Slap delay, not quite fitting here. Take a stone out of a wall. Maybe an eighth delay with an... One day it will tumble down. Okay, you can configure your delay and reverb mix and then use it on every track you want just from one send. Yeah, and we can just look into the Halls of Fame plugin once more. Um, basically, this features an EQ to quickly EQ your uh, reverb and has some features. You can manipulate the IR. You can add some pre-delay, uh, attack release settings. You can trim off the end in case your reverb is too long um, and stuff. Input output setting and you can also reverse it. And we like to normalize it so it goes to zero and it's always the same level. Yeah, so this is the, the effect routing and the Halls of Fame plugin, which is included in Mixtemple Pro. Um, I hope you liked it and uh, you, you get the idea how to use the template, the channels for Blabbery, and of course the Halls of Fame plugin and the effect routing. Thanks for watching.